Okay guys, we all know what that is, it's a pine cone. Now with my rocket fuel heater I'm burning pine cones and they burn absolutely exceptionally awesome. Get the dry ones, you can tell the dry ones it's quite open like that. Oh man, do they burn awesome. If you dip a, this in a little bit of oil, or just sprinkle a little bit of oil, it all gets trapped in here in these little grooves and they burn amazingly hot fast or if you want to slow a fire just put them in as is. Always whack an extra one in while the flame is going though, otherwise they can be a bit smoky starting up, you know. So if it's uh, actually going, I reckon instead of adding three at a time, add one every say 15 minutes or 10-15 minutes while the flame's going well and it won't smoke. This is completely smokeless, it's a brilliant fire. It's so well, I've also got a new uh, invention too. I get uh, these bricks, um, I don't know if you can get them in different countries exactly the same shape, but with this hole there and the shape, it actually blocks that hole up a bit. So I can regulate the heat um, coming out here. So it's gone down now, it's um, the flame, but you can just sort of pull it out a little bit and the air can still go in here. This end actually catches on fire and keeps the fire lit. So if you interrupt the fire in here and it actually goes out a bit, which is common in this type of thing if you muck around too much, this will actually just reignite it. It's brilliant. They work so well. I'm really happy with the results. So kind, uh, pine cones, guys, absolutely ring. I'll tell you where I'm at. I'm at a campground in Byron Bay at the Byron Bay Blues Festival. We've got a massive lineup, BB King, Jethro Tull, all sorts of people. It's just going to be absolutely insane. So uh, there you go. There's your, there's your, um, there's your uh, pine cone rocket stove. Cheers, guys.